So you're gonna have guys that'll frame on your hip and your face. But let's just deal with one thing at a time since these problems arise, we'll talk about them. So if I feel, let's turn. If I feel the guy is really strong here on the hip, or if he's got the bone in there, that one, like what I'm gonna do is simple. Shoulder latches, cut, rotate. So try to keep that grip. And then I'm back to here. And even if he does keep the grip, that's why we go into the hydro, because look, right here like this, how's the pressure? It's still good, of, right? Yeah, it's out of my ribs. Still good. How long is he gonna stay there? I don't know. See, all right, change. I put him under pressure, I'm burning his grips. So when I'm doing this, this may be enough right here to pop up, rotate. It may not, he may, he may go like this and still reset, but it gives me enough time to go here. Okay, and then from here, I could reset and play in these positions. Just know the more I'm here, more pressure. Less, I have to worry about him doing more attack to me. So if I stay, ultimately if I get in a habit of staying here, he's not really finding those corners very well <clears throat> to push off of. <clears throat> Covered all of them, so you couldn't say it wrong. Right. Just know this, we're focused on this. One, two, and then it actually, you have the same kind of thing happening on the hips just a smaller version, okay? You're doing most of the work here with your upper body and your chest and your arms, okay?